Hello and welcome to Castanet's AM Update for Thursday, July 9th. Here are some of this morning's top stories. A new chapter has begun for the Central Okanagan's two major food banks. The Central Okanagan Community Food Bank will amalgamate the Kelowna Community Food Bank and the Westside Community Food Bank under a single umbrella. The amalgamation means reduced costs, reduced administration and a larger outreach for both sides. A family friend is hoping to raise money to continue the search for Curtis Wilson. Wilson is missing and presumed drowned in Kalamalka Lake. An extensive search of the lake by RCMP has turned up nothing. Now friends have started a GoFundMe campaign in an effort to hire the renowned underwater search team of Jean and Sandy Ralston. A BC conservation officer suspended without pay is back on payroll after he refused to euthanize two orphaned black bear cubs. Following widespread public outrage and an online petition with over 73,000 signatures, the union confirmed Wednesday that Bryce Cassavant is being paid again, but remains suspended pending an investigation into the incident. And police have now identified the man who crashed his single-engine plane on the highway near Soyuz on Tuesday. 46-year-old Todd Lewenden of Surrey was airlifted to Vancouver General Hospital in critical condition with second and third degree burns. Be sure to check out castnet.net for more on those stories and up-to-date news as it happens.